So here in this video, we're going to find the circumference of a circle. And the formula that we use to find the circumference is c is equal to 2 pi times r. And the c stands for the circumference, and pi is the never-ending number, which we usually round to 3.14, and r is the radius of the circle. And most of the time for these problems, you're given the radius. So if you're given the radius, you just need to plug it in to our formula, and we can find our circumference. However, for this particular example, we're given the diameter of the circle. Notice how the circle has a diameter of 10 meters. Well, the good news is, is that if you're given the diameter, it is really easy to find the radius. The radius is always one half of the diameter. And I'll write this down for you here below, just so it's easier for you to remember. So once again, the radius is equal to one half of the diameter. So if we know that the diameter is equal to 10, then we know that the radius is one half of 10. So the radius is going to be five meters. And now that we know our radius, we can use our circumference formula. The circumference is equal to two pi, all multiplied by our radius. And now we know that our radius is 5 meters, so I'm going to plug in 5 meters for the radius. And now the only thing that we have left is just multiplying. We have 2 multiplied by 5, so 2 times 5 is equal to 10. We still have our pi, and we still have our units, which is meters. So the exact circumference of this circle in meters is 10 pi. But a lot of times your teacher or your textbook want your answer in decimal form. So in order to do this, we need to round pi into a decimal. So the approximate value for pi is equal to 3.14. So I'm going to plug in a 3.14 for pi. And once again, we still can't forget about our units, which is meters. And finally, the only thing left is just multiplying. If you plug in 10 times 3.14 into your calculator, we get 31.4. And once again, we can't forget about our units, which is meters. So the circumference is approximately equal to 31.4 meters. And the circumference is just this outer edge of the circle, or you could say the outer boundary of the circle. So the distance of this outer boundary of the circle is 31.4 meters.